If you are looking for the best inflatable kunai, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on your personal preference and started it based on their features, prices, quality, durability and reputation of the manufacturers. Also, we have included options for every type of customer. So, let's get started. At the 5th position of our list, we have Intex Challenger K1. If you are looking for fun but don't have a lot to spend, the Intex Challenger K1 might be the key yacht for you. Lightweight, inexpensive and safe, this budget-friendly yacht can deliver good times if you keep your expectations reasonable. The K1 is designed for a single paddler and larger adults may find the hull of a tight squeeze. It features an inflatable seat and footrest, but don't expect any room for gear. Users report that this little yacht is stable, but its handling and tracking aren't great. In practice, that translates into a fair amount of valuing as you battle despite the equipped skeg. But while the K1 is in the boat to choose for an expedition, it's more than adequate for a day on the lake of a quick river. Customers report no trouble with stability. It's easy to set up, though a bit hard to dry out at the end of the day due to be enclosed bow. We recommend letting it sit in the sun if you have time, and be sure to search the knots and crannies with water with a dry towel. Be realistic. This is a budget product and it delivers budget performance. The skeg frequently falls off, for instance, and you can't expect it to have the performance of inflatables that cost 10 times as much. This is not the most durable inflatable, and it's best to keep away from impacts and chop objects. But if you're looking for low priced fun, you could do a lot worse. The number 4 position is dominated by Sea Eagle Inflatable 380X Explorer. Sea Eagle's 380X Explorers is the tandem kayak that all other inflatables should be compared against. It's built for fun and lets you enjoy the water with a friend or two. Given that it's weighted for 3 people, it's also been certified as capable for up to class 4 white water. And if that's something you think you would enjoy, the Explorer is a fantastic option. This kayak is at home in waves, surf and white water, no question, and uses remote rock solid stability. If you do manage to flip this kayak, its open design makes it very easy to re-enter from the water. It comes equipped with two comfortable seats, but there's a plenty of room for a third passenger, a cooler or whatever gear you might want to bring with you. The Explorer relies on three chambers, boat, start board and floor with three resists one way valves. There is an inflation gauge on both sides so there's no guesswork when preparing this yacht for the water. This kayak's toughness is legendary. Constructed from 100 dinar reinforced PVC, it will stand up to some pretty serious abuse. Don't worry about landing on the beaches, running a river or slamming into a rock here and there. This boat can take it, but it's an inflatable and knives and sharp metal are something to watch. Inflatables aren't known for their taking and handling, but the Explorer comes with a removable skeg to improve these characteristics. And while you can't expect the performance of a sleek car shell, this yacht is a solid performer compared to other inflatables. User reports that the entire package kayak pump and pelts gets heavy fast so don't let the relatively lightweight of the kayak itself fool you. And the Explorer is a premium product sporting a premium price tag. So if you are not on a tight budget, this may not be the kayak for you. Moving on to the next act number 3 with Drift Sun Viagra 2. Drift Sun's Viagra is a tandem inflatable offering plenty of reasons for a close look featuring comfortable back-supporting seating for paddlers. If you are looking for a smaller kayak with a well-conceived design, this might be the boat for you. It's made from tough 840 Denial Nylon with a PVC tarpaulin bottom, while not as durable as some of the other boats we reviewed. This kayak is robust enough for what you are likely to throw it on a lake or a calm river. It's not designed for white water, but for recreational paddling, that's really not an issue. It's also easy to inflate so you can get into your adventures quickly. To improve handling, it features a removable skeg, but as usual, don't expect miracles. Waggling, however, is less pronounced than in other models we reviewed. Putting this yacht closure to the head of the line, stability is excellent, and in the worst of cases, this yacht should be easy to ride and re enter from the water. It features a spray skirts both for and off, and even rigged for two. There's a plenty of room for gear in both bow and stern if you need more space. This kayak can also be adjusted for a single paddler, giving you ample room for whatever you might want to bring along. The number 2 position is held by Advanced Elements Lagoon 1. Advanced Elements Lagoon, like their AE-1007, uses an innovative design to improve handling and tracking. In this small kayak, rigid panels define the shape of the bow and the strand, while they go to the same length to close the performance gap between inflatables and hot shells. Don't expect miracles. Users report that this kayak leaves them feeling secure, so stability shouldn't be an issue. But keep in mind that this boat is intended for calm waters, as its name suggests. 
And despite the narrow rigid bow and stern, the lagoon's handling is in first rate. Expect some wiggling from side to side with each stroke and don't anticipate awesome tracking in a stiff breeze. Designed for a single paddler, the seat is comfortable, but paddlers with the longer legs may feel a tad confined. Storage space is minimal unless you lash gear to the bow bungees, but this yak is pretty small. If you're looking for more space, you'll probably want to consider some of the tandems. Setup is easy and inflation can be done in a snap, so you'll be on the water in no time. Finally, the number one position is dominated by Advanced Elements AE1007. Advanced Elements AE1007 is about as close as you will come to hard shell performance in an inflatable. Supported by a foldable frame and supporting a rigid bow and stern, this yak will cut the water much likely like a conventional design. Often with the skeg, tracking and handling are excellent, and this kayak is probably the best of the boats reviewed in these respects. The AE1007 is a tandem design, and it comes equipped with two removable and repositionable seats. Most kayakers will find it quite spacious. Though there is a surprisingly little room for gear while rigid for tandem paddling, it's easy to convert to a solo kayak, though giving you plenty of space if that's what you need. This kayak relies on a tough three-ply fabric and six separate air chambers to provide Beyoncé, Properly inflated, it's a safe way to enjoy your time on the water. Expect excellent stability, and with an open design, you can be assured of easy re entry should you end up in the water. Customers complain that said cup can be complicated by the folding design. Drying can be an issue, too, as the exterior fabric stays wet for a while. Keep in mind that this kayak is on the heavy end for inflatables as well. That's all for today. We upload product review videos in every single day, so don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for the upcoming video notifications.